Hey everyone, Tiara from Shop Like Me. Today I am trying to redo this video because I was disappointed with my last one. My May finds at Dollar Tree. Okay, so I want to apologize up front that I am sick, so my voice is a little messed up, but I did want to get this video out because I've been sitting on it for a while. Um, but here is a bunch of aloe waters that they had, and they had this ocean spray pink. I thought that looked good. And then these rice cakes. And they had these youth face protection masks and the summer stuff. So the goggles, the snorkels, the swim floaties, and all of that kind of stuff. And you'll see me just kind of like jump around the store and show you anything new that I see at this store. I did go to the newer store, uh, which was much more stocked than the previous store I went to. Again, the summer outdoor toys, the baseball bats with the balls. I did end up getting those colored baseballs for my daughter. And then the 4th of July stuff is starting to come out, which I had shown one thing in the beginning. Um, and then just other outdoor stuff like torch fuel. We all love organizers. Those were uh, the stand up paper organizers and then also like pencil boxes. And I did buy a bunch of those. And then I thought these trays were really cute. They had matching bowls um, and plates in different sizes. And you can see those are really cute. And then these Hot Wheels, this location had tons of these Hot Wheels. I know I've talked about them in previous videos, but tons of them at this location. And then I thought these were cute, these little vacation uh, wheel cars. These brick stickers I thought were interesting also. So I'm just showing you each style that they had there. The zombie, the police, and I don't know what that was. And then this I thought was cool. I almost bought it. It says it's gross 600%. It was already pretty big, so 600% is going to be insane. But pretty much the instructions say put it in the tub, fill it with water, and it grows huge. And then also, um, once you take it out of water, it'll go back down. And there was some slime. And then these look like name brand Puppy Friends Club. And then these little dollhouse toys. I thought these were cute. And my daughter loves Peppa Pig, so here I got some Peppa Pig stuff. I ended up buying her one of those. And then there's some little unicorn toys. I thought the wings would move, but they did not. And then some puzzles. I did buy my daughter one of these also. These puzzles. They were like thicker quality, pretty good. So I bought my daughter this one here. And she put it together that night. And then I don't know if this is a real like brand name with a final faction. I'm gonna move on to the education and craft section just showing some of these the new things for like teachers or education if you're doing at home learning or whatever this would be great for you or if you're a teacher and you need to do your room this is great time to stock up now when everybody else is not because you know come August everybody's working on it and everything's gone so now is the time to come and get your good stuff and just stock up over time and I wanted to show some of these coloring books um, and how big they were, but I thought those were cute. Especially that Paw Patrol. My daughter loves Paw Patrol. I'm going to skip on over to the office supply section. Here there is some more pencil holders. And then they had these uh, like paper stacking trays. I did buy some of those for um, my poly bags for shipping stuff. And they work good for the smaller sizes, but not for the big sizes. And then I thought these little pencil holders are really cute. And I just bought a Cricut, so I was thinking about putting something on those. So I bought some of those. Um, and pretty much I was going through this store looking to see what's new, plus anything I could use with my Cricut just to practice using it. But I thought this adhesive cork strip was good. This right embossing stylus I thought would be good for my Cricut. And also they had felt rolls, which I thought would be great for my Cricut as well when I get to projects like that. This would be a good blank for the Cricut, putting something on there. And then I thought these would be great for the Cricut to put things on there as well. And you can see they're a little flexible. And then I heard you can cut uh, these off to make any pin work in your Cricut. So like I said, I went there mainly with the focus on Cricut. So you're gonna notice a lot of things that can be used as blanks. Again, like glitter paper, paper, other things I typically might not look at. Um, I just had a different focus for this trip. So this glitter paper was really pretty. So I just wanted to show you all the different colors that they had. 
and then they have these little stickers which again i was thinking about cricket uh slime balls that was new i had not seen that before super blast art that looked fun and then the just the mini mouse stuff if people are like me you love like taking notes and doing things physically still um and there was a little note taker i thought was cool if you have a dog they had lots of stuff for dogs this location stays stocked up on dog stuff and these glitter candles, I thought these were really cute. I was actually really surprised to see those at Dollar Tree. And then these prints as well. I'm jumping back and forth, but here were some more candles that I saw. I thought those were really cute with the little 3D rainbow and the little whale. And then there were some other candle holders. It was all kind of just mixed mash hodgepodge. Again, like I said, I had the Cricut in my mind, things that I can custom make. So I did get some of those, uh, glasses there that you see in little vases and jars because I thought those would be great blanks for a cheap price I saw these you know I had never actually seen these at Dollar Tree and they were stuffed packed so these are the 3d wall art if you watch my, my old videos I have one doing it but it wasn't with the Dollar Tree one and then I thought these are really cute they've been having these signs lately but those are really cute and then I thought these would be great on a kid's wall or in a kid's playroom or in a, a mud room and the little astronaut there was cute moving to the cleaning section i found these so i thought this would be great for the summer so i did buy a few of those because they'll probably be gone come time when i need them and then i thought i'd show the dog section or the pet section for people that have pets um I thought there was some pretty good brand name stuff out and available. And this little yarn ball was like calling my name. I wanted to buy it as a gift for my mom's animals. And then these I had never seen before. It's to keep your drain from getting clogged. And then again, here I am looking for blanks, uh, Cricut blanks, and then the magic erasers to clean the Cricut pad. And I've never seen this print for the fabric brand, but I did go buy that really quick. Here's another blank option, which is using these little ear pod cases and then using them for masks to hold masks. I did hear that on somebody's video. I thought that was a great idea. And these little fashion gems were new. Never seen those. I've never seen these headbands or this brand. I think it said Sincerely Jewels. But there's uh, these different headbands here and these hair pins and these hair ties and I did buy like one of each one of those for my daughter another Cricut blank idea would be the back of a mirror like for weddings uh bride bridesmaids gifts stuff like that um or just anything you need a mirror like sweet 16 or just for any sort of girl and then I thought those socks were cute you know I have a thing for socks and these will be also good blanks these little makeup bags and I thought they were cute designs. And then more blanks would be these hats here or bandanas. I thought about doing custom bandanas. And then I also saw some bags. So custom bags, toiletry bags, just pretty much anything that was flat and uh, was able to take heat to set it. Moving on to the baby section, they had these little mermaids and these little airplanes. I thought they were so cute. I had spent like full price on those when my daughter was a baby. Uh, more blank things like the soap holders. And then I thought these sponges were really cute. So I thought I would show them there was a cupcake. There was that rainbow. And I just thought they were really cute. Loofas, loofas, loofas for everybody. This one has wings. And this one is a cute little rose. Now, I don't know if this is a name brand, but it sure looks like it. Hair gunk, hair gel. And then this was in the baby section. I thought it was so cute. It was a snack container. So there was a whale and there was a koala. Um, it was very comparable to like the munchkin ones that my daughter uses. And I really liked it. I thought it was real chic. And again, cricket in mind. All of these things are good, perfect blanks to add vinyls. Not necessarily that they're new or anything like that. And then also doing a welcome mat um, with the vinyl and these pillowcases. There's these different styles of pillowcases. I did think that one was nice and abstract. And then just a plain black satin pillowcase, so great for blanks. 
And then I saw these electric toothbrushes for the kids. I grabbed one of those for my daughter. And then there were some more of those gems, a different style. And then they had the Paw Patrol toothbrushes and some lip gloss surprises. And to the food, corn tortillas, good price. I bought those. I had some quick oats and some grits. And then, like I said, you always check the bread because it says name brand bread at Dollar Tree. I think Fridays is their stocking day. So um, get your bread for just a dollar. Don't pay three, four, five dollars for your bread. All these name brands are right here at Dollar Tree every week. Like my last video, I found some more of this Loma, um, I believe it's organic, meals. So it was a different flavor, so I did show that one. And then again, more bread. I hadn't seen these before, the Lunchable Cookie Dunk, so I wanted to record that. Um, these vinyls here are like um, wall coverings or count, not counter coverings, but like cabinet coverings. And I just wanted to show all the different styles because it was pretty stocked. I've shown these before for organization, but they would be great blanks as well for using your vinyl with your Cricut. And the same with the mugs, the plates, the chargers, all that stuff would be great for vinyls and the Cricut. So like I said, I had that in mind this whole time, which is why my video looks really different this time. I was loving these clear plates. They look identical to a high-end plate that is really popular. Um, so if you like that style, definitely go get yourself some from Dollar Tree and don't spend all that money. I believe it's like crate and barrel or something like that. And then, of course, they always have great wine glasses and stuff, too. So you can get that high end look at a low price. Again, these are great blanks. They have these coasters here and they match the placemats right next to them. You can see like in the background, they match these placemats with the coasters so I thought those were pretty cute I've been wanting to buy these cutting mats for a while but I just haven't um but I did hear you can use them like on top of your cutting boards so you don't ruin your cutting boards so I might get them next time but you see the picnic basket not the picnic baskets the little baskets for the food plus the wax paper you put in there I thought that was a really cute little cutter and then I thought that was a cute uh ketchup and mustard container as well and I, again, more blanks, um, doing the pot holders would be great with the vinyl, the iron on vinyl and tablecloths. And I apologize. I just, I can't really think straight because I'm sick. So I'm trying to catch up or keep up with the video and I'm having a really hard time. Um, organization stuff. Of course, I always gotta show that. I thought those were unique sizes. And I just love those gold wire bins. They are so like luxe looking. I just don't know what I'd use it for. So I can't justify buying it. Although I want it. And these match those other ones. They are a little wider. Um, and again just organization stuff. I did buy some more stuff. I have like in my dining room. It's just like piled up with bins and tins. Because I want to do my pantry. So right now I've just been like accumulating these. Until I can figure out how I'm going to do my pantry in them. So I've just been buying a bunch and just setting them on the floor till I can, well, get some energy because I'm sick. So I can't really get anything done. But I'm going to get to them, I swear. They had these tumbler cups. These were cute. They already had stuff on there. So I don't know about using them as blanks. But maybe if you just wanted to add somebody's name to the already existing design, that could definitely work. And then they had these storage containers also for the pantry. Um bigger and smaller ones and like I said the store was just all around way better stocked up and then these were cute these would be great blanks as well and then the flavored lip balm and I think I'm nearing the end of the video so I'm just gonna say now make sure to like this video subscribe to my channel thanks for watching you guys um while I wrap this video up hey get your aloe now to prepare for those sunburns and this is my last thing leaving on those good vibes Again, thanks for bearing with me while I was sick. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel.